I'm not really sure why I'm doing this. My mom's a fucking bitch and my dad's completely lame. I just want someone to talk to and be myself around, so I'm talking to you and we'll be friends, okay? Shh. The dream killers are stirring in the hallway. My life-sucking parents named me Susie Anderson, but from this point on, I'm changing my name to Selena Ravenvox. My mom and dad hate me. They just had me so they could come home and make someone just as miserable as they are. I have one true friend, Astaroth Darkchiller. His parents hate him too, which is why we get along so well. It's a shame he's gay. Oh, but don't bring that up because he's in total denial about it. I wish someone would come and take me out of this hellish existence. Not some man-child who'll never reach puberty, but a dashing gentleman who'll sweep me off my feet. A vampire. We could sleep all day and then go out at night and feed upon all the cheerleaders in my school. Mm. Want to see more? Bet you do, sicko! Now pay attention, because what I was saying was important. Oh, I know what you're thinking. There's no such thing as vampires, Selena. You need help, Selena. Save it. That's what vampires want you to think. How else would they be free to roam around at night without that Hugh Jackman or Matrix guy bothering them? Remember, all fiction is based loosely on fact, some more than others. And before you hit me with that Vlad crap, let me be the first to enlighten you as to what a clever smokescreen that is. And as for the Twilight faction, if that's your idea of vampirism, I'm not even going to waste my breath on you. My name is not Bella, bitches. <sighs> Dad! It's your turn to take out the trash. <sighs> From now on, I want you to call me Selena. Selena. That's a cute name. Well, okay, Selena. I need you to take out the trash because it's Susie's turn to do it. Susie died. You know, I think you'd be a lot happier if you had more light in here. It's always so gloomy. Is there anything about me that you like? Well, of course, dear. You'll always be my little pumpkin. Right now you're going through some changes, testing our patience. I get it. You will too when you grow older. Oh, and don't forget the dog poop in the backyard. Love you. I HATE YOU! Now you can all see why I have this! I bet you thought I was exaggerating when I said that he hated me! Don't forget the dog we've in the backyard. Love you! Bullshit! 